Hey everyone, Jelani Smith here, Applications Engineer for Trimble Perspective, and in this video, I will discuss how to create a project within Perspective, how to set a password for your scanner, as well as go through how to capture scans. So let's get into it. Okay, so first and foremost, you need to create a project. To do this in Perspective, click on the new button in the upper right corner. Or, if this is your first time opening the application, click Create New, which is in the middle of the screen. First, choose a name for your project. Next, you have the option to designate a picture to represent the project if you'd like. Additionally, the index option lets you choose which station you would like to begin your project. And lastly, there's the option of Project Description. Now once you are ready, click Create. Next, connect to your instrument. To do this, click on the Wi-Fi icon, and you should see a list of available devices to connect to. Ensure that the serial number depicted on the screen matches the one on the instrument, and press Connect. Now, to set a password for your instrument, go into the top left corner and click the icon depicting your scanner, Wi-Fi, and battery life. Next, click the Wi-Fi icon and you should see the option to change the network password. Click change and set your desired password. The scan settings allow you to choose the length and time of your scans and allow you to toggle between standard and high speed capture with the difference being the number of points captured, the range, and the space in between points. Additionally, there is an option to capture images alongside your scans. HDR images are available as well alongside other options to account for the weather or lighting you might be scanning in. Once you have configured your settings to your specific workflow, click Start Scan and watch magic happen. Okay, now two things I would like to highlight are registration and labeling. Typically, for registration, your scans will automatically register to the last station completed or to whichever station you have selected as last. You can also manually choose which stations you want to register to each other. To show what that looks like, instead of automatically allowing the first station to register to the second, I will click Station 1, then create a link between Stations 1 and Station 2 then click register. Additionally, to register stations to each other manually, open the split view mode and click two areas that are present in each station to tie together the stations manually. Lastly, labels can be used to mark important information regarding one or more stations. To show what this looks like, I'll create a label titled First Two Scans to illustrate that these two stations were the first two that were captured. And now I'm able to view just those stations labeled. And with that, you have successfully completed your first scans. Now I thank you all for tuning in and I hope that this was super informative. And please be on the lookout for more content because it will be on the way soon. And until next time, see you guys later.